God ain't forgetting what those motherfuckers did to this place, Mr. Clay. I won't. Sure, see him. Oh, God damn it. Okay. Get your ass home in one piece, MJ. You all right? Far fucking from it. Sinclair Paris. That mean anything to you? Nothing good. Black folks, anyway. Sheriff Department down there still thinks Jim Crow is a law of the land, so we're building a civil rights case against him. Been working with an attorney out of Washington, D.C., knows people in the FBI. That what that call was about? One of my men, named Ezekiel Dandridge, was down there meeting with folks, getting him to agree to testify against the Sheriff Department. He was compiling evidence, uh, testimony, getting folks' names. We we're gonna turn it over to that attorney. <sighs> then he ran into a motherfucker named Sheriff Walter Slim Beaumont. <sighs> I was on the phone with him when it happened. I'm getting ready to leave now. I know. Yeah. Okay. Kinda laid out, ain't it? Are you having car trouble? No, sir. Everything's fine. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Why don't you come on out here and let me get a look at you? What you doing around Sinclair this time of night? Passing through, sir. Passing through. That's nice. Beautiful night for passing through, ain't it? Who's that on the phone? My mama. Your mama. She worries. Just letting her know when to expect me. That's mighty nice. I bet she appreciates that. Yes, sir. It is a beautiful night. Don't let me keep it. Especially what with your mama waiting and all. Jesus. 
and another brother falls. Lincoln, this is my daughter Roxy. She grew up in Atlanta with her mother. Pleasure to meet you. I'm Lincoln. Lincoln Clay, I know. Daddy, I already told you I can handle this on my own. There's too much at stake. The case, people's lives. Can't take any chances. Heard you ripped Dixie Mafia a new asshole. <laughs> Left one of them hanging from a Ferris wheel. He killed someone close to me. Seemed like a good way to pay him back. Slim and them motherfuckers who work for him. Dixie Mafia ain't nothing compared to them. We do this, you do what I say, when I say it. Yes, ma'am. Uh, the two of you need to get on down to Sinclair Parish and get that folder. When you got it, bring it here. <clears throat> Meet me outside when you're ready to go. Your ass is driving. She was supposed to be with ZQ. Blames herself for what happened. Blame's an easy thing to put on. Hell of a lot harder to take off. We'll get this done. Of that, I have no doubt. Sinclair Parish? <laughs> yeah, I, I remember Sinclair Parish. <laughs> You, you need to understand that back then, uh, local police, sheriff departments, they operated with absolute impunity. And no one operated with more impunity than Sheriff Walter Beaumont. Beaumont used his power to keep Sinclair Parish white. Places like that were called sundown counties. If you were black and caught around there after dark, well... That would be the last time anyone ever saw you. Well, let's go. My pops gave me the rundown on how you two fucked up those dicky assholes. What you did to do that? That was stone cold. Did what had to be done. Yeah, I'm sure you did. But listen, if one of these Sinclair deputies ever tries to pull you over, don't stop. They'll kill you and me without a thought. New Bordeaux police don't exactly walk around giving black folks hugs. Now, ain't no disrespect, my brother. But take out Slim like you did Richie Doucet, and in their minds, that's just gonna justify everything they be doing. That's gonna make shit even worse. But you, you ready to just go out and kill them all, huh? No, just the ones that matter. Yeah, well, he on our ass now, so a low profile done come and gone. 
Now get us the fuck out of here. Yes, ma'am. Take a couple grenade. Air Force. Seriously? Move, man, move! Shit! Let me try! Hold on, hold on, wait! Where'd that motherfucker come from? Thought you wanted to keep a low profile. Yeah, well, he on our ass now, so a low profile done come and gone. Now get us the fuck out of here. Yes, ma'am. Get on them, Jay. Jesus Christ, Roxy. I've dealt with asshole cops before, but goddamn. They'd rather ice your black ass as soon as look at you. Now I get what you've been saying. Those motherfuckers are a whole new brand of intense. And keep your eyes open for more pigs as we head through town. MJ Farmer's up ahead. What's MJ like? Sinclair born and raised. He a white boy looking to make a difference. You trust him? Of course I trust him. Although I think he got more balls than sense. Sounds like my kind of people. They sit up here? Yeah. Foxy Roxy. I ain't seen you in a good minute, girl. MJ's waiting for y'all in the greenhouse. Now you say hey to Lula oh. and them babies for me.
They need a place to lay low, send them my way. Look after yourself. Ain't you two a sight to behold? <laughs> yeah, we just a regular old beauty and the beast. Lincoln here is beauty. Name's Miss, but most folks call me MJ. How's the drive in? Got a warm welcome from the Sinclair Sheriff's Department. Goddamn assholes. Since the uh, thing was EQ, Slim's had them high alert. And when'd you get back? A few months ago. This is my ticket home. Lost part of my stomach? It was about a year ago. Shrapnel? Hugh got hit by an RPG. And next thing I know, I'm on the ground with part of the tail rotor sticking out of me. This helps with the pain. God damn. So my best work. That cop friend of yours got us a line on our missing folder. Mickey? Yeah. Tommy Slim's got it locked up down at the station. Don't suppose there's an easy way in and out of there? No, not unless you're invisible. Hmm. Them motherfuckers don't leave much chance. So I should probably wait until it's dark. Try to get in when most of those assholes have gone home for the day. That's what I was thinking. Slim's a slippery bastard. Unpredictable. So I'm gonna tag along and help keep an eye on things. I'm gonna be waiting for you outside. Appreciate it. And MJ, you might want to get in touch with that cop friend of yours. Tell him to call in sick. Oh, that motherfucker's long gone. The sheriff's station usually a skeleton crew this time of night. Surprised you didn't go in and snatch the files yourself. I thought about it, but I suppose you deserve to have a little fun. Hey, you generous. Don't fret. I'll be keeping a bird's eye view on things from nearby. Give you a heads up any way I can. There's me up here. Cool. I'll grab the files. Where should we meet? I can make my way back to the phone. And Lincoln, keep your head down, all right? Since the day I was born. Around the station. You touch that car? Hey, what you been in it? I thought so. All your shift's done. I want you to take a rag and wipe oh, it I'm down. Oh, I'm sorry. Any place you might have touched, and anywhere else for that matter. You're a whole lot less trouble for everybody. Hmm. trouble. Oh, okay. Try not to let him put another hole in your ass. You got away with words, Roxy. Spent. I'll give you that. Ah, shit. It's at the station house. I'm Come taking the lead. Scene on site. Get behind me, boy. Come on. 
get by somehow? I say we keep hunting for it. Gotta be somewhere. Let's just keep looking. I got eyes on Back me up here. Ain't getting to you unless he goes through. another call. hands away from my balls. Piece of shit got away. So 
it somewhere else. You check Slim office yet? It's on the second floor. Sneaky motherfucker. Not yet. Why haven't I? I got it. You having some trouble over there? Nothing I can't handle. Meet you back at MJ's. All right, and keep the cops off your ass. A mess of deputies coming through the back gate. Watch your ass.
I was wondering when you was gonna show up. You doubt this boy from the hollow? Let's just say I'm still surprised you ain't fuck it up. Give me time. I'm sure I'll find a way. Slim made some notes inside. Highlighted a few names. Fuck. Slim already gone to work. Some of these people done gone missing. Which means they're probably dead. He knows the names of the people we've been talking to. God damn it, we've been working at this for almost a year, putting everything together piece by piece for it to all fall apart now. Ain't nothing falling apart. We always knew the motherfuckers hit back. These folks gave their life thinking we was gonna see this through. We still got the pictures, the written testimony. We ain't gonna let Slim worm his way out of this. So, what's our next move? I'm gonna call the folks on this list and tell them to get the fuck out of St. Clair. After that, we gonna see about Slim and his asshole friends. Thank you. You got a minute? I need some help getting some fertilizer in here. Like it? Any old asshole can grow some skunkweed in their backyard. It takes an artist to get in there, start mixing strains and shit. Gotta respect a man with a passion. Been growing long? Since I got back. VA shrink said I was suffering from intrusive thoughts. Couldn't get down with the meds he gave me, so I started growing. Shared my first crop with some friends, and word travels fast. Good weed does that. Cops? Yeah, cops are so focused on keeping St. Clair white, they haven't noticed the new shade of green popping up. Lucky you. Plus, I kind of got a referral system, so I don't have to worry about any old asshole talking to the cops. You can just dump that right there. Don't mind the mess. So you got a pipeline into New Bordeaux? Nah. You know someone who might be interested? I might. We'll talk more once things settle down around here. Thank you for the help. Want to take a hit? You shouldn't have. Fuck. You put your foot in this, boy. Goddamn right. Well, let me see if Roxy needs help digging through the files. That could take a minute. Enjoy that. We should talk business later. Hope you packed the coat, man, because there's a goddamn ship blizzard headed our way. Got in touch with everybody in there except three people. Andy Lafayette, Gina Paulson, Eddie Hanahan. Slim cornered them, cut them off. Only a matter of time for he moved in. And that's just the start of it. Whole parish is locked down. No one gets in or out without Slim say so. Like I said, it's a ship blizzard. The fuck we gonna do? Those three, you know where they at? Yeah, we got somebody watching them. If you charge in guns blazing, it's just gonna get them killed. But if Roxy and I pick up a ride, bust around Sinclair kicking up dust. Motherfuckers ain't gonna be able to resist a chance to hook a couple niggas on the run. Exactly. And while all eyes are on us, MJ steals around town, grabs those three, and brings them back here. You think you can handle that? Fuck yeah, I can. Got something else that'll help. My night crawl. Zekia was driving her when he got got. We steal her back? Ain't no way she ain't gonna turn heads. What's the impound lot like? About what you expect, man. Cops, alarms, big-ass fence. Ain't like we trying to bust into the Federal Reserve or something. Yeah, 
Right. I gotta go call my old man, tell him what's going on. You come find me when you're ready to head out. All right. Well, fucking shit, Blizzard. Get the witnesses. Keep your head down, MJ. Can't force that, Sergeant. Now, if blank your hip hop, I'll call you when we done. You ready? Come on. Well, come on. Let's go get my car. Get that talk from your dad? You can say that. He wanted to remind me of self-sufficiency of a revolutionary black woman. <laughs> His black ass way of saying don't get shot. <laughs> well, you ain't wrong. You can drive around shit, you know. Yeah. Anyway, so what's the plan for getting your car? It start on a dead man's switch, I think. Who needs a dead man switch in their car? Lincoln, I'm parsing to my wheels. Point is, I'm the only one that can get my baby started. So you and me need to get into that lot, I'll get her running, and we'll get moving. Probably gonna set off some alarms. Yeah, well, that'll be our cue to haul ass. You can drive around shit, you know. Like I was saying. Yeah, well, that'll be our cue to haul ass out of there. You know what? We should keep our heads low while we inside. Let's sneak in, get my car, and try not to get shot. Hold up, Mr. One Man Army. I didn't get to finish it. Okay, then what you did for what you did, Reed. Come Damn on. Well, how's my baby? Uh, the stuff Probably was the where they got my funny. baby. And the spaceship was neat. And I like But did you have to give him your name? That was uh, kind of weird. I made it personal, that's all. Hell, I can put you yeah, in the next draft if you like. Uh, no thanks, man. Quiet I'm as good. Can. Fellas, I'm tired of this sneaky shit anyway. Let's get my baby and go. Deck is stacked against you, boy. All in all units, reports of an intruder at the impound lot. Suspect is a colored male, approximately six feet tall. He should be considered armed and dangerous. He's hiding over yonder. No trace of him. These targets have got to go. Of course. Oh, you're you're welcome. Use the ramp.
We about to do our thing, Mr. MJ. You ready? Not ready. Good. We're fixing to raise a little hell. Give you time to get the first witness. Let us know when you got him. 10 4 status out here. I'll be in touch. Let's tear up Sinclair. MJ, do your thing. Time to see what kind of damage your car can do, Roxy. More of them on the way. Uh-uh. Now here go another one. Another one coming. I think I got him. Yep, I definitely got him. More rednecks rolling in. More of them on the way. There's a billboard in town for Slim's re-election campaign. Worst We're ways to get right? the sheriff's department's attention. Now, as long as you don't mind the stretch pain a little. Attention. Let's roll. The sheriff's department keeps a checkpoint just outside of town. It sounds like you're proposing we drive through a mess of deputies just so they'll call in more pissed off cops. Shit, girl, you know how to have a good time. Shoot! They called they Sheriff Slim Beaumont reaching out to our new guests. Don't even know if y'all can hear me. We ain't used to our colors being this. Rambunctious in Sinclair. I'm looking forward to giving y'all an education. Laying down some law and order. Sheriff Beaumont out. Oh, I'm on the way. More rednecks rolling in. VIP retreat. Thanks for sending out the welcome party. They ain't I'm gonna get the these one. good old boys. Holy shit. Holy shit. Suspects here! The nightcrawler is in the outside facility! Get your asses over here! Plenty of shit to blow up around here! I say we get to it! Got him! More of them on the way! Got enough! This is Sheriff Bohan! Any one of my deputies gonna deal in. with this fucking plague of Negroes? Oh, hey! Brother, you okay? That good old boy is good and day. There ain't no end of these good old boys. Did that hurt, baby? Hey, brother, you okay? And stay there. That's good enough. Now let's get the hell out of here. Slim's using the county fair for a little re-election party. We hit that, it'll piss Slim off and the fuckers looking to keep him in office. Phew, they called they friends. Oscar Mike with a VIP in the back. Moving on to the next one. Phew! They called they friend.
Keep your foot on the pedal so we can keep them pigs off of MJ's ass. Oh, well, this is Chef Beaumont here with a message for our new friend. Thought y'all could buffalo slam, didn't you? But don't worry, I got some for y'all. Oh, oh Rednecks rolling in. Holy shit! This is Chef Beaumont, now, one of my good? deputies. Please deal with these Don't niggas. Fuck with me, boy. Up, Staff Sergeant, I'm gonna need an assist. I got multiple tangos on me, and they ain't in an arresting move. Hold tight, MJ. We're coming for you. That good old boy is good and dead. They friends. There ain't no end of these good old boys. That good old boy is good and dead. Cute. They call they friends. Hold on, hold on, wait. Couple of arrows. How are the VIPs? Oh, but if she can't find us down on ashes, they ain't gonna last long. Oh, shit. Oh, Redneck, hold on, hold on, wait. Well, they know we here. Well, you can make it, Staff Sergeant. I was VIPs. Oh, but if she can't find us down on our asses, that ain't gonna last long. Hold on, hold on, wait. Gonna need an assist with these pokies. They call they friends. 
Motherfucker. Didn't I tell you? More balls than sense. We ought to regroup at the farm. You driving your baby? <laughs> Goddamn right. Look like you half knew how to drive. Thanks, Roxy. I'll see you back at the farm.